Let me just put on a light. Women at this Michael, have you finished editing my book? Almost. Isn't it fun? Have you come to the part where the androids have an orgy and wind up devouring each other? Oh, I love that part. Uh, not yet, but I'm looking forward to it. What do you hear from Nick? He's all right. Dr. Let's hear it. Still pissed at him over our little prank on Fire Island, are you? Dr. Let's hear it. Still pissed at him over our little prank on Fire Island, are you? You are forgiven. Nick, I'm not so sure. Give him a call. He'll appreciate it. Would you give me another treat? Certainly. Excuse me. Why don't you pack a little bag and fly to Paris for the weekend with me? I have a standing reservation in the Concorde, a suite in the ATM, and a box at the opera. I never dine at a restaurant with less than two stars. What do you say? Kim Webb, Saturday morning. Well, I told Joan I'd buy one of her paintings on one condition. Somewhere in it, she has to have Edith Piaf. Douglas adores Piaf. Edith Piaf. Douglas! How's Morgan Guarantee treating you? Fine, thank you. Hey, how's about if Michael and I come visit your house out at the island? The season's over and the house is closed. Ah, oh, shucks. Hey, looking trim. So are you. I'll have the last laugh. I may have committed the gay cardinal sin of being a bit overweight, but it's the self some so called unattractiveness that spared me from the plague. Exactly. Come on, Douglas, you're not that overweight. Now, what about that painting over there? That's nice even without Edith P.I. Oh, Yep, I had a boyfriend in high school. They freaked. You know, the usual bullshit. How could you choose this kind of lifestyle, Peter? I said, hey, guys, it chose me. I mean, your dick knows what it likes. You reach puberty, you don't fucking decide which sex you like. You ask your dick. You say, hey, dick, what do you like? Okay. All right. And you go for it. 